So my first question is about the speechless, which I absolutely loved. Thank you. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. Uh, I I thought uh, Jasmine deserved uh, her own uh, anthem. So I'd like to know what would you, what did you want to achieve with uh, with the song? How did you come out with Jasmine's song for the 2019? Right. Well, first, it's a new collaboration. Yeah. I was working with this team of Pasek and Paul, who mm -hmm. are a wonderful songwriting team on their own, but they came in to write lyrics with me. And um, I just love being in the room with them and working with them. That was delightful. And um, the influence certainly was a more contemporary influence. Mm -hmm. um, and at the same time, it was, yes, a soaring anthem yeah. for Jasmine to say, look, First, I don't want to be speechless, and then in the, later in the movie, I will not remain speechless. Mm -hmm. She you know, sort of stands and delivers this number. Um, I wanted to deliver a song of appropriate emotional power. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, I, I felt, once we demoed the song, I said, oh, this is a special one. Yeah, yeah, it is, it is. And the first one, uh, the music numbers, and, and the music also uh, has a lot of influence for uh, the, the actors. The, it has a, a Robin Williams vibe. This one, uh, you get to uh, give uh, the Will Smith Will vibe. Will Smith, yeah. yeah. I, I'd like to know if they contributed to... Contributed? Uh, yeah. they, <laughs> they did all the work. <laughs> they did all the work. You know, <laughs> I mean, you know, like Robin Williams, you know, Will knew, learned the songs and mm -hmm. then made Ms. Oda. That was the job. I like, you know, I like what I do to being an architect. Yeah. You know, I build a house others are going to live in and I'm go in live in it and make it your own. Uh, it's not the only one uh, movie you are you're working uh, right now. You're no. starting with uh, The Little Mermaid. Mermaid is starting up. Yeah, and uh, I'd like to know if you heard the um, these rumors that are on the net that Zendaya is the main choice for Ariel and Lady Gaga is for uh, Ursula. You, I know you can't tell anything, but I'd like to know your opinion because there are two uh, power stars that could be great for for the roles. Here's my opinion is yeah. Rob Marshall is directing the movie yeah. and he's going to make the best decision <laughs> um, and uh, I admire both of those mm -hmm. those art artists immensely, um, and uh, would love to work with them on anything. And I'm just the composer; I'm not the director. So I I can tell you that uh, I don't think there's any official yeah. casting that's happened yet. It's very early stages, but certainly dream on. It's, it's very exciting. And uh, since you were playing when I entered the, the Enchanted soundtrack, oh. I can't wait for the for the sequel. Do you know anything? How how are things with Enchanted 2? It's because still still in the early stages, trying to get the script right. Yeah, and that's where it sits right now. So it's it's not it's not greenlit yet, mm -hmm. but it's hopefully soon to be greenlit. Don't you think Giselle deserves uh, more credit on the on the Disney princesses? Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, yes, yes. But I think the time for Enchanted, you know, is going to come again because Enchanted was one of the great conceits mm -hmm. of any of the story, which is you know, an anim animated ingenue is brought into our modern world and she's you know, walking amongst us, like, on well, what? Where am I? It was such a great idea, so much fun. Yeah. <clears throat> and to bring back a sequel, you really have to serve that idea yeah. in a new and interesting way. So we're working on it. So I have uh, a little time and I'd love you to, to play me like I, a whole new world because I'm such a romantic. <laughs> yeah. I can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, now when did you last let your heart Decide a whole new world. Da -da 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 -da. Place for you 